Oh, wait, Fellow Nerds out there, this is Jordan Bowman Richie, and welcome to the demo of Firefighter 2 B Bang. So, you guys probably remember when I played this and it, this game, and it, uh, you probably remember when I played Liar Liar and Liar Liar 2 against the fire back in like. Wait, how long ago was it? Oh, it, oh, it was about a year ago. Yeah, literally just a year ago. Actually, it was, it was really all of, all of the year ago. Like, it's almost been a year since I played those games. Uh, so this is actually the demo of the remake of the demo for a remake of the second game. The first game hasn't gotten a remake yet, but the second game is getting a remake, and this is the demo version of that. You guys probably remember how ridiculous the story was uh, back then too. Oh my God! It, because we actually get to play t the shoes of this girl. Who is a yandere? Uh, but enough of that, let's just get on with the start game. Hey, it's you again. Oh, our, our sprite does look a little different now that, now that I look at it. Thanks for your help earlier. I really appreciate it. Huh? You mean what happened afterwards? That's not really important in the grand scheme of things. One or two people. <laughs> yep, that's exactly what I expected. <laughs> yeah, you'll probably, you'll probably don't know, but this is just how the game is. If you, if you haven't seen, so if you haven't seen the first, the first uh, video, I recommend you go and check it out for yourselves. It, it gets a bit crazy. What's with that look? Okay, okay, fine. It was more than a couple, but no more than ten. Because she's so nice to everyone. Just because a girl's nice to you doesn't mean you can get up in her space. But anyways, since we, since we were in the, our last year of middle school, we graduated. We're high schoolers now. Isn't that cool? My pretty, my uniform is pretty cute, right? Unfortunately, me and me don't attend the same school anymore. Isn't it such a bummer? What a great opportunity! Wasted.
thought he was dead. Is he dreaming? Is he dreaming? I don't see it. I don't see it. Oh, you see that's Tommy Vito over there. Oh, that's Tommy Vito. Oh, shit. Oh, Tommy Vito. Oh, Tommy Vito. This is no dream. This is a nightmare. No, that me who knows. Hey, Seth, that's not because my mom's dead. Hey, Yukari. What do you want? I suppose I can't really shake you off or anything. How humor you? Follow me. Discussing boys deserve to live? People who take advantage of others hurt others in, in, in any way. They should be punished. God, you haven't changed at all since we broke up. Have you? Have you? I guess not. But you haven't changed either to not have. If you are morality still black and white. Rhetorical question. I know it's, I know it's still is. Ugh, this is Goodness, you picked up. What's up, Buttercup? You're not going to believe this. Let me guess. Tanaka isn't dead? Huh? How'd you know that? Mm, it's a bit of a long story, but basically. Who told you to call me, Toro? I want answers. It was Tanaka. Oh, she's not go. That's not possible. No, it is. You asked me this yesterday. It's all very small. I've seen them being not him. It's cute as a little sheep. Aww! Oh. You're my son. Don't tell me. He turns into someone that helps you last me. Not by... I don't know what that's in favor. Favor? Or 
sitting here today. See? Well, that's a little hard to ask, but I know you can. You just need that. What? Oh, uh, Where is she doing this? Just need a pair of extra eyes right now. Oh, uh, you can count on explains a few things. This is pretty annoying though. I guess I all I have all I really have to do is make sure that Tanaka doesn't follow me to school. That should be easy. I'm a master of avoiding all my problems. <laughs> trust you to do anything right now. I bet you're playing something suspicious right this moment. Eric! No, I'm turning along. Uh, you're so annoying. I'm annoying? Or you? Oh my my my, is this a start with lovers quarrel? This isn't anybody's business but me and Yukari's. Ah, uh, but it is. Akira? My name is Akira Tobitaka. I'm a member of the student council at the school. If there's any arguments here among the students, I'm expected to take care of them. Well, Toby Taka, I'm glad you've introduced yourself. Even if I didn't care for your introduction. But you are not needed here. We're just getting along fine without you here. Aren't we, Yukari? The question has been a casual statement. It's a threat. But I've never been one to take threats seriously. Actually, we're not. You're not? No, we're not. Yukari! What is it, Tanaka? You got something else to bother me about? Well, I suppose we do have a problem. Don't we, Tanaka? I think you should leave the bit uh, alone, Tanaka. Is that an order? I'm not going anywhere, Tobitaka. Block with your bite, huh? I like it. I don't like his face. 
but I think we we should let the lady decide, don't you? Um, I'm pretty sure we just go home with neither of them, right? <laughs> There's no no direct benefit for me to go with either of them. I'm just gonna go home by myself. I think I'll pass. I'm going home by myself. They, they both brought somewhere for all I care. I don't have time for either of them right now. I have to hurry up and meet me up with Miho. Finally, I'm here with a useless baggage to slow me down. I think that I was able to shake both Akira and Tanaka off, so I think I'm safe. All I have to do is find where Miho is and we can start this investigation. Oh, there you are! Oh, hey! I was just gonna start looking for you. Well, you found me. Should we start looking some clues? Sounds good to me. Me and Miho walk briskly towards the end of the school. This is where we had all the bodies and previous victims to rock. And where we had the Tanaka to presumably die as well. Hopefully we Hopefully when we get here we'll figure out what we're dealing with. Well, here we are. Huh? Where are the bodies? Oh my god. Where could the bodies have gone? Did they all rise from the dead like Tanaka? Oh my god. Yukuri, relax. I can't relax when all the corpses are out and about. Yukuri, listen to me. There's a rational explanation for all of this. If there is one, I'd like to hear it. Well, to start off, corpses moving around is irrational. There's no way a corpse can shamble around. Second of all, if they really did come back to life, I'm sure we would have seen at least one of them other than Tanaka by now. You suppose so? Well, I don't suppose. I don't suppose so. I know so. You know what I think? No, I'm not really sure. I think Tanaka moved all the corpses. Why don't we do that, Miho? Well, I think I do, Yukri. Let's say that we did actually manage to make a mistake and not actually kill Tanaka. He doesn't report us to the police, but instead, I doubt that he has a personal agenda against us. Something even the police can't help him with. He wants us to squirm. Well, we're not going to let him get away with it. No, we're not. Okay, the piano is actually starting to get kind of annoying. <laughs> it's time to show Tanaka a lesson he'll never forget. Me and Mio decide to regroup the next day and corner Tanaka for the information tomorrow. If he won't confess to the location of the bodies, we'll just have to kill him. We'd kill him even if he did tell us, but that's just a secret between you and me. I see, Yukari's been quite busy. I'm sure she'd love a helping hand. Tanaka was, wasn't was here at school today. It's not very like him. It's very troublesome since I was going to interrogate him today. She gives us such a pain. <laughs> Uh, I'm again. So tempted to tell this. He's the pain. Right. Oh, well. I mean, really. We're busy, but. We're busy right now. Just a bit. I see. That's quite a shame. What did I have anything to do with Tanaka? What? Was I right away, some shit? What if I said it was? What if it didn't work? Oh, it's my face. Everyone walks up and says, Mr. Nikonel, I can see him. He's not really having a hot chin as well, so. There's no real way. Mm hmm. I recognize this goes out class that's in that's in disuse right now. Well that's not ominous at all. But it's not like I have anything to move but just by walking in. So so were you gonna show or tell me anything? That was a whole day. Uh what I do with your suit. 
You're playing something funny, and you're moving gently. Seats are not going to crumble to any sheep in the ground. There are dozens of bruises. And is that blood? You like what you see? Do I look like I do? Tonka starts to stir a little and starts screaming. I didn't ask you to do this for me. Besides, this is unusually cruel. Unusually cruel? Usually I would accept that as a compliment. However, it's a little rich coming from a little murderer such as yourself. I'm a little concerned that he knows about my murder spree. But it's certainly, he certainly has a point. But even I don't go out of my way to beat someone up for fun. My murders are quick to, and to the point. I don't enjoy emotional torture. Quick and merciful is my way. This is just wrong! Of all the people, I thought you would des derive at least some pleasure with this. I went out of my way to take care of someone that was bothering you, and the least you could be is thankful. Why would I be thankful for you brutalizing him? This is just as boring as the rest. I hear kicks to knock down the ground and talk about some pathetic boys and just come. What are you doing? Stop that! Worthy of my time. Help me kill Tanaka. You don't need him, right? Why bother keeping him alive? Join me. Uh, no! Fuck you! No matter how you look at it, this isn't right. Tanaka may be trying to blackmail you, but. You, but this isn't exactly what he was getting at. As much as you want to kill him. Maybe you want right to get you want right to get rid of him. But how much you want to defeat the other ones? I can feel Akira. It's not right to kill him. I'm trying to make him for the past place of me. I mean Ugh, I can't read today. Are you trying to make him past crimes by trying to be a good person now? Well I hate to be a bearer of bad news, you're a little too late for that. What makes killing Tanaka any different than killing some other guy that you've killed before? You're, you're past to the point of no return. You can't atone for your past crimes, you free. Kira looks in the script of Tanaka and he crumbles to the floor. Tanaka looks at me with all those eyes. Kira moves towards you slowly until the last moment she can be alive. Maybe change. And yet, Kim. You can't break the past. But you want to make my decision. Even if it's last week. You ready yourself to be a dick. Oh god. I care the dog quicker than you think. There's no one there's absolutely no recovery from this injury. You're done for <laughs> You black out and Tanaka springs to his feet with a triple speed and grabs your hand. Then he's out of the class with Kira out on your heel. He leads to a nearby bathroom and locks the door. Excuse me, I'll Stay in silence on Tanaka and try to play with the bathroom windows. No use of seeing shot. Both trapped. Silence makes you uncomfortable. But. Makes you uncomfortable, but you can't really talk the at the moment. You feel yourself slowly losing your grip on the waking world. The devil is not attached to you. Mukuri! I'm so sorry this happened. I didn't mean for it to end this way. You gurgle as reassuringly as you can. I know you two are in there. Come on out. You agree? I'm so sorry. There you two are. Being a student council member really has its perks, huh? I'm clean keys to all the rooms. Tucker plays himself in front of you. His last gesture of goodwill, you suppose? It doesn't mean anything at this point, but you appreciate it. You wonder in vain at what could what could have happened if you made a different decision. It's too late for that now. As a cure advances, Tanaka holds your hand. Everything goes black. Add it. Blood night. Oh, this is the demo, and, and yet there's, there's still many things. Yeah, I already got one ending. Okay, uh, let's go back, and let's just go home with Akira. Oh, no, not Akira. Uh, Tanaka. Let's go home with Tanaka. Going home with Akira seems to be a pain, like a pain in the butt. You probably
probably annoy me to death when I just talk about this in council. Either way, I don't really trust him. There's just something about him that I don't like. Everything about him seems so fake that I, can, that I can't stand to talk to him for no longer than three minutes. Hmm. Even though I hate to think about it, going home with Tanaka might be the smartest idea. At least with Tanaka, I, can, I, know, I know I can shake him off like I did earlier today. I'm going home with Tanaka. <laughs> well, looks like we have a winner here. And it's not you. Alright, fair enough. If that's what the lady wants, so be it. Jeez, there's no gloat there's no use gloating if the other party isn't even upset. Well then, let's let's get going, shall we, you three? Whatever, let's get going then. Right. See you later, Akira. Akira watches as me and Naka head down the hallway. She stare burns a hole in the back of my head as I pick up the pace. I didn't pick Akira. What a creep. Saka so seems giddy over his fuel victory over Akira. But he won't be, be after I ditch him. Goodbye, devil wizard Tanaka. Good riddance. Ah, Yukari, wait for me! Wait for me, Miho, I'm coming. Okay. Oh wait, isn't this the save? Wait, so we I wanna hope we can check out this time, so Oh wait, I mean this is just a demo, so maybe it only has one ending? What, what if we what if we did join them? I'm pretty sure that is also a bad ending, but like I remember getting to the end of Liar Liar 2 before. I getting that good at or whatever. <laughs> you know, Kira. You're right. Tanaka has done nothing but be a nuisance to me. So I know what to give around. I would have been a lot happier to have been the one that put him in put him in the ground. But this is fine too. Smart choice. Looks like this is the end for you, Tanaka. Truly misfortunate. Tanaka places a cure, Mr. Britain. She gives you a final glance of her help. Any help at all. Kari, this isn't you. It's too bad. It, it's too bad it is. Even as the warning aside for much too long, I'm trying to just be rid of him. One person, two, ten people, a thousand. It doesn't really matter how many people you kill as long as you can get away with it. Taka lets out the key. Like, Tara slices his throat open with blood. Blood bubbles at your feet. Rose to Naka. Oh, that nasty. You did not come to me. What? You mean? I mean exactly what I said. You're much too bored with what I expected. I don't quite need you around anymore. Uh, taking chances or run? Oh, I actually have a choice here. Holy crap. Um, okay. Now I feel like if I run, he's gonna kill me anyways. I, mean, I don't think it matters if anything. You know what? Run. We can be from Cure Strike to you. Oh shit. Wake up, darling. He pulls it sharply at your hair, causing you to let out an involuntary yelp. How long have you been out? Hours? Days? You have no time to process the wishes when the cure's life catches you. Even if you're such a deep sleeper, you quickly try, you quickly try, try to assess the situation. The cure knocks you out as only you still by the hair. You don't recognize your surroundings. You have no weapons to speak of. What are you going to do? If you're going to kill him, just get on with 
it. Oh, you what, what, what would be the fun of that? It's a whimper. I didn't care too much about it. Drunk on me, I don't care too much. Oh, I know. Uh, I have to keep an eye on you. coming. Bad end. God is dead. Okay. Well, what if we took our chances then? Or you... Oh. It literally doesn't matter. Okay then. Okay, what if we just denied his request? Well, do you mind? I don't know why he's back, but I'm not t too keen on finding out. The priority here is recruiting me home and finding out how to get rid of him. Yes. So this is the, this seems to be the same dialogue. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if we go, what happens if we go home with Akira then, because most of the dialogue is is been. Oh wait, <laughs> I almost forgot my avatar. Whoops. Um, but yeah, most of the dialogue seems to be the same. So I'm just gonna go see what happens if we go home with Akira. Pretty sure it's just gonna be another bad ending. This is actually a great opportunity to get rid of Tanaka. This is God's way of telling me that I should t that I should take this chance. I'm gonna go with Akira then. I'm glad we make the correct choice in choosing me, Yukari. Well then, shall we be off? Don't, we'll be off, Tanaka. Don't wait up. Let's go, Yukari. Yeah, whatever. Let's go then. Me and Akira walked outside the school in the direction of my house. He won't stop talking about student council activities. Am I boring you, Yukari? Oh, uh, he kind of was. He kind of was. No, of course not. That's why I love hearing about all this student council stuff. That, that, that I know nothing about. You don't have to lie, Yukari. It's written all over your face. Well, I guess I won't. To be honest with you, Akira, you know, I always have to go home with you so I can ditch Tanaka. I'm not interested in getting to know you better. Frankly, I couldn't care less. And besides, don't you have, like, 500 other girls that wait that weigh on your hand and foot? I'm not interested, and I don't want you following me around. If you're, if you're going to talk to me, find something more interesting to talk about next time. So, see you later! Well, well, well. She certainly is an interesting one. Alright. So now, I think, I think we just get that bonus even to knock on, that's about it. Oh, wait, no, there's new dialogue! This is really troubling. I decided to follow despite her wishes and see what she was up to. But this is a little more than I bargained for. Fai's being missing is something new. Th that's not something I did. I wonder if she has something to do with it. I know what's happened yesterday. I met some friends today to get ready to come. Mio hasn't shown up yet, but she'll be here soon. I gotta, I gotta keep an eye out.
kill me. threats can be quite hefty anyways. Considering it's not like you to even do the dirty work. You just have someone else to do it all for you. Don't you agree, Yukari? That's alright, Sonata. Nothing really wrong with that. If you need something done, then but can't quite do it. Might as well be a, get a low struck idiot to do your dirty work for you, right? Pushes his way past it as it runs out the door. I can't really blame him for this one. That was really hard to hear. Oh, leave him alone, go after him. I don't remember from before. Uh, you know what? I mean, might as well, might as well uh, go after him. What's not because was way too harsh. You knew he was kind of an asshole. But you didn't know he was that big of one. That wasn't right, Tanaka. No one knows Yatoru was okay. Such a jerk. Yatoru and Yukari God made neither of you, neither of you two, have much to say. That was quite harsh back there. But I can see where you're coming from. Well, I'm glad to see at least someone agrees with me. I don't find anything in particular wrong with people using people. find a way to convince you not to not kill you. You highly doubt that the, the first probability of you can re-cooperate with Miho ever again. Her threats are empty, but they don't hold any substance at all. Despite this, you wonder if you, you should tell her what you know. I her face tell her the truth. Eh, tell her the truth. You don't think it's a very good idea to lie to Miho. You're per... You are particularly good at lying, and it doesn't seem like, a, and it doesn't seem like a good idea to leave Mio on in a wild goose chase. Well, I'm actually not sure. It's a very, that's not a very funny joke. If you didn't do it, then who did? Well, I might, I might not know what the corpses are. I know someone who might. 
Well, you, you finally managed to pull through after all. Don't hold back now. Who is it? It's Minami. Somehow I figured she's never really liked me. I wouldn't doubt that she would do this, do this to trouble me. You neglect like to mention that just because someone doesn't like you, they wouldn't go out of their way to transport corpses to trouble you. Trouble you, but, but you refrain. So what exactly are you planning? Well, since I have a suspect now, we are going to have a talk with me to me. We? Yes, we. Aren't you curious as to where the corpses are? You don't need that leverage to pull one over me. Over me and you, Vinny. Wouldn't you, wouldn't you feel bad if me and me somehow dies while we have a nice chit chat? You don't really want to question me to me with me, Hotel. But you really have no choice. Talking with her alone is out of the question. Me and me's safety is at risk. You'll be smarter if you tread carefully. All right, you lead, Sonoda. Oh my god, this is actually a lot longer of a demo than I thought. Um, probably gonna cut this uh, cut this video short for now. So, if, even if we're just approaching an ending, it, it might be a shorter video then. Uh, this is still just a demo, so yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to leave a like, comment what you think, share this video with your friends, and be sure to subscribe, subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss a single notification. I'll see all of you in the next video. Goodbye. You say you want to try, but you never do. Sugar, there's a reason.